Shocking revelations by the Parliamentary Legal Affairs Committee indicate that a team of UK lawyers and Ugandan lawyers defending President Museveni over the sale of Uganda's properties abroad inflated the bail from 160,000 US dollars to 30 million US dollars. According to the Parliamentary Legal Affairs Committee, member Charles Ayena, Government Attorney General Peter Nyombi informed the committee that in this case in which a Briton of Ugandan origin, Jess Mashati, sued President Museveni was to cost not more than nine million dollars. But I think it goes to over ten uh, million dollars, upwards of ten million dollars. With this contradiction at play, the UK High Lake Official Whistleblower reviewed by the Ugandan parliament and submitted to the British law enforcement agencies calls for criminal prosecution of Uganda's Attorney General and lawyers allegedly involved in defrauding millions of dollars of taxpayers' money. The report says Uganda's Attorney General duped parliament into releasing the funds separately. The report says since General Yoweri Museveni was sued in 2006 in his personal capacity and should not have been entitled to Uganda taxpayers' money to meet his legal cost. To the extent that the matter was against the person of the president, I do not see why public funds should be used to finance the representation, the legal representation. Available investigation documents show that the former Attorney General Kid Makuya won against paying for Mr. Museveni's defense. The report has already been referred to several agencies, including Serious Organization Crime Agency and sent to the UK Judicial Oversight Organizations that monitor lawyers' ethical conduct. In another development, the Parliamentary Legal Affairs Committee is questioning how a Ugandan law firm, the Kampala Associated Advocates, was procured to represent General Museveni in the London case. They derived the formula for arriving at $1.8 million. This is what we are questioning. Whereas Kampala Associated Advocates sought to be paid $1.8 million, the leading UK firm Edwin Coey, LLP, sold nearly $29 million. Timothy Basi, the Kampala.